What is up everybody, Spidey here, and as always, I hope you're having a marvelous day. I've got a treat for you. I really hope it's a treat for me. We've got another box, or should I say 10, of 2021, released in 2023, Marvel Premiere, up next. Now, the last time you saw me open this product, I opened up three of these tins, uh, one in one video, two in one other video. And in the first video, we hit pretty big. We hit this Psylocke, uh, this triple panel here, also has Vision awesomely on the back. And we also hit this Red Hulk, because you get one single panel sketch card each time. We got this one here, cool card. Uh, but in our next two boxes were just massively duds. I mean massively duds. Because in this product you're going to get either a triple, double, or dual. Um, you're going to get a 5 by 7 or a quad panel at the top of the 10. And man, we just, it was about as bad as it could get. Again, no slight at the artist, but in terms of like what people collect and what they'll pay for, these two ain't it. Very, very low uh, tier characters. Although this, I think, is Groot. At first, I thought it was Stegron. I was just kind of in my feelings about it, I think, more than anything. But I think the question now is, can we, uh, can we turn the tide? Can we hit a couple of big sketch cards, maybe a big base card? You know, we did okay on base cards. We hit Carnage and Gambit being the two biggest here. Uh, Carnage out of 25, Gambit out of 49. But you know what? <laughs> you know, maybe this will be a little bit of redemption for the last two boxes. Who knows, but I've got to also give a big thank you to my friend Ed Webb at Sci-Fi Cards. He made this box break possible. And by say by possible, I mean he was willing to accept money in exchange for the 10. <laughs> he is in no way sponsoring this video. Might not even be, uh, want to be associated with this video. I don't know. But either way, very thankful to get this product from him. It's always nice when we can support a local shop like Ed has. Hey, my friends, the seal is broken. The value is gone. All that's left is a good time, potentially. <laughs> this product, uh, it, it's not just its not just like chasing a base set or something. Like everything in this is a hit. Um, it's an all numbered base set. And then you do have some other chase cards that are unnumbered that are like shadow boxes and what they call breakouts. All right, so let's get into this thing. I'm going to, uh... <laughs> that always just makes me so nervous because you know, the top card is one of the big hits and it looks like we got a dual panel. So we're gonna just slide this over here. We're not gonna look at that. We're gonna save that till the end. In fact, let me put it here just to be safe. Here's our pack. In our pack, we're going to get, for those who haven't seen this product open, we're going to get really, um, what we're going to get is two numbered base, unnumbered card, and sketch card. A single panel. Whew, makes me nervous. There is a possibility of getting a printing plate booklet, but I don't think we've got that. I have seen that hit. That's an incredible hit, by the way. Ooh, I think I've revealed something there on accident, so if you saw it. Come on, Pat. Ooh, this is not going well. Yeah, got it open. Oh, great. More Hercules, my friends. If you can't see, we hit two Hercules sketches out of three boxes, which is nuts. Don't want that to happen again. That's an out of 99 card, so let's do this. So we don't reveal the next card. Number 47 out of 99. Set that there. Our next hit is Storm. Well, that's a great looking card. Look at that. And it's red. So when it's red, what that means is it's out of 25. So that's a great storm. Out of 25, a red storm. Let's look at the back again. We're 12 of 25. Okay, now we're going to reveal this here without revealing our sketch. Shadow box here of Green Goblin. That's appropriate for Halloween, right? And this shows us the stages of art. 
And I don't think that one's a short print. That's number 15. Well, it may be short print, but it's not super short print. But I'd have to check the checklist. I like it. And to reveal our sketch. Okay, so we know this is Dennis Hendry. We know it's a beast. A beast. Man, I feel like I've been hitting a lot of beast sketches. Why not a, why not a Spider Man sketch? And I don't know this artist, so yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to reveal it. Whew, man, my luck with this has not been good. It has not been good. No slight to you, Dennis, just not my style, not the level of detail that I want in a five to six hundred dollar box of cards. But what do you do? Okay, so we so far we got a nice storm. And we've got whatever is behind this. So I want to reveal it this way. Are you ready? You ready? Three, two, one. Okay, okay, that's not bad at all. That's actually pretty cool. Star-Lord, Drax, and Gamora. Dual panel sketch. And I don't recognize the artist, but it looks like Emery, maybe, or something like that. Let's go to the back. In the back, oh, it's Eric. And the back has Rocket in the classic outfits. Eric Betonin. Tunnin. <laughs> Eric. Eric, thank you for the awesome sketch here. There we go. So if you are a Guardians of the Galaxy fan, this is the kind of sketch you'd like to hit. I, I do not collect Guardians of the Galaxy. I wonder if that's Ego right there. Kind of cool. So yeah, let's see if we can't pop this out all the way. Boom. Oh, sorry, Beast. And take a look at this thing without the plastic around it. Very cool. Very nice Star Lord. And again, this is a dual panel sketch from Eric. I like that he added Rocket on the other side. <clears throat> so there you go. That is basically what we've hit in four boxes of Marvel Premiere, and I would say for the most part that Marvel Premiere has not been kind to me. Uh, definitely not getting my money back. Um, that is for sure. But either way, fun. I've seen some amazing sketches in Premiere. Uh, one of the guys that got one of the Ed Webb um, boxes, he got a Fred Ian She-Hulk. So they're certainly out there, just not here at the Spidey Hits house. But I do thank you for watching this. If you like this kind of content, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video, Spidey hit that like button for me. If you have any questions or any thoughts, leave me a comment down below. Do you like the sketches? Do you like the B sketch? Storm card? Let me know what your thoughts are. But as always, I hope you have a marvelous day.